Hello everyone, my name is Dominono and welcome back to Dead Space 2. Moving on with our lives and away from... Well. Hello. Ooh. Well, I did everything I could. Huh. You're a little quick, ain't ya? Not anymore. What do you know though? Actually, like, people being horribly murdered. What a strange, strange world. But it's... There was actually a uh, power node room back here, then, wasn't there? And having just picked one up, I suppose it's not unreasonable to want to know if these ones are actually worth it or not. Yes, use it. Unlock. Were you worth it? Probably not. You weren't in the first game ever. Text log. Ruby Semiconductor. Quarterly economic report. Amazing. Unemployment grew to 9.5%, collateral job losses, ongoing collapse, local planet cracking. Aftermath of the Ishimura incident continues to depress all planet cracking activity as more and more support services go out of business, leaving less and less capacity for planet cracking. However, Titan Station continues to boast a small profit, buoyed solely by the cash influx from Earth's Gov scientific research and operations facilities. Human needs and services organization has been spared the brunt of the planet cracking collapse by the pickup in traffic with government sector. Ah. Heavy losses to all the planet cracker stuff. CEC itself has found a moderate new life its facility in the R&D department. Eh uh -huh. Oop. What exactly am I picking up here? Ripper blades. Med packs, but my inventory is now full. Great. Well, maybe we should see what the rippers are like a bit more. The ripper's fairly cool. Uh -huh. How can you possibly stop this, for goodness sake? How? How on earth were you meant to, like, fight against that, for goodness? Like, come on now. Ooh, credits. Oh no, another one. How about you just don't? Hmm? How about that? What do you say to that, buddy? Four... 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 Oh, fortune. I thought that said four foon. I was like, huh? That's not a word. Get your four foon out of here. I need to find a store so I can sell those semiconductors, don't I? I guess I'm just moving on with my life here. Oh, I'm not actually controlling that. It's just telling me that there's no access to most of the place. Oh, here we go again. <laughs> That's a clunky reload. Hello? Oh. Yet again, I did everything I could. I tried so hard. Oh well. Isaac, Blimey. Isaac, over here. Oh hello. It's you. It's the drugs, Isaac. They gave us drugs to make us forget. Mm -hmm. But it's all coming. I don't know what you're talking about. Why are you calling me? Isaac. Isaac, look out. Huh? Oh. Well... <laughs> I'll tell you what, that was pretty cool, the whole lookout thing. Because A, it made me worry like, oh, something's coming up behind me, and then surprise, turning around means it's now coming up behind you. That was pretty good game. That was pretty good, I liked it. What's that over there? Is that just a rig, or is that something pick up later? Well, I mean, waiting times around here are murder, huh, buddy? Okay... Is all that shit? Is that the way I'm going? Yes. So, anything cool over here? No. Fuck all. Great. Still, I thought the plasma cutter was fucked up, but the Ripper, the Ripper is a babe. Sounds like a lady's in trouble in there. Isaac Clark, quick, to the rescue. Or, perhaps not. Well, I tried slightly harder than I previously have. See you later, lady. Oh. Oh. That was cheeky. Cheeky son of a bitch. What the hell? What? Why does that doorway connect to this place? That's a weird layout video game. I probably wasn't supposed to think about it too much, was I? Where did those two go? Did they run off or... I don't know. Still, the Ripper seems to be a horrifying piece of shit. 
What's up with you? Well, I don't mean to be a downer, lady, but your mum didn't do so hard in the end. <laughs> the old fire's pretty good too. Oh dear. Javelin spears. I imagine those bolt people to walls and shit. That's probably quite funny. But so far so ripping. Kelly ripping. Did I pick up stuff from you? Did that toilet just auto flush or? Am I to anticipate an Ecromorph coming out of the loo? That would be highly unpleasant. Like, it's already pretty bad, but... I don't know. Somehow the idea of them, like, actually being in the... Like... Lavatory systems is... Really quite gross. Laundry. Ooh. Hello. Friends. Romans. Countrymen. Okay. Why does it sound like there's someone in there? I can't decay it. This is a really fucking moody washing machine. <laughs> How strange. Are you gonna, like, are you gonna reveal something that's going to sneak up on me in a second, or...? Hmm. Okay. This door's locked, so it's safe. The Ripper is a hilarious monster of a gun. Okay. Am I good now? No. Nope. Oh. Hello. <laughs> All three of your legs. Oh dear. Okay. I like the Ripper now. Was it like this in the first game? If it was, I would have tried it a bit more. How tough do you think you are? Not tough enough, in any case. Oh, you're alive. <laughs> no, you ain't. Oh dear. Ripper's fun. I like the Ripper. Ripper's a cheeky bastard. Giving me a lot of javelin spears, weirdly, which is strange. I was under the impression that it wouldn't give me ammo for guns that I don't have. Why am I under that impression? Did it do that in the first game, or do I just believe that it did that in the first game? I probably just believe that it did that. It probably, there's probably no precedent for that whatsoever. Goodies? Anything? Corpse, are you hiding anything useful? No. Huh. This is a, like, clearly this is a big place. I thought that this might just be, like, the psychiatric facility, like, as a station, but this is clearly, like, a, um... Like these are apartments and whatnot. This is like a proper well-off, like ecosystem all but all to itself, out here on Titan Station. Okay. 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 See you later. I didn't even want to come in. Ugh. It's fine if nobody invites me to parties. Didn't even want to go to your stupid apartment. Ooh. More text. Tell me, what do you say? United Spacefaring Guild History Series? Titan Station. Conquering a moon, part one of two. Planet cracking first became feasible. You decades following discovery. United Field Theory. Blah, blah, blah. Large-scale applications of graviton control. Shock point drives. Dangers of planet cracking were unknown. Saturn's moon Titan. Site of the first moon harvest. Far from Earth, the consumers willing to work and still have reasonable access to time suppliers and support. Huh. Okay, so Titan's moon was actually the first planet crack, was it? Yeah. That's reasonably interesting. That's a whole bunch of graffiti. There are necromorphs everywhere. Is the entire sprawl infected? How this happened? The marker was destroyed, and I destroyed it. You destroyed a marker, Isaac. Tyman built another one. Oh, nice. Good job. Why? It's powerful alien technology. Tideman wants that power. Okay. Get to the tram. It'll take you to the Cassini Tower Planet. Data? Damn it. What if I can control the alien monstrosity? How often has that ever worked for anybody? Even not even once. 
Let's control the xenomorphs. Oh, they killed everyone. Let's control the predator, sort of, kind of. Oh, it killed everyone. Let's control the zombies. Oh, they killed everyone. Let, like, why? It's like sci-fi just doesn't exist in these kind of worlds. On account of all the stupid, stupid decisions these people make. Crying baby. Can I save you? No, probably not. I'm probably just supposed to listen to you. Are you alive? Nope. Okay. More contact energy, but I'm stacked up on it right now. I don't know what the uh, loading space is, though. Blimey, that is some reload. Hey, bingo. You? Are you reloaded? I have a whole bunch of plasma energy. Oh, no. Let's maybe try and burn through a bit of that. Oh, I can't go through that door. Fine. That is one weird banjo. Crying child, crying woman. Hello, lady. I'm here to save you. Ignore the part where I just stomp through a carcass. Hello. Oh, you're dead. Well, I tried. Oh, hi. Yeah, my face. Did you hit me? No. Huh. Well. A for effort, I guess. That was bizarrely non-startling. Hello? Was that a thing? Nope. Holy shit. Mm hmm I can't tell if this is actually on the verge of cracking and becoming exposed, or if that's just an effect. Probably the latter. I think it was... Oh, right. <laughs> you stayed upright for a fair bit. Yeah, I'm already well aware of you guys. Huh. That's... Yeah, seizure warning. Med packs. Stuff and things. More contact energy, I think. Oh, no, I can fit another stack of that. Rifle. More rippers. Solid. The thing about the Ripper that makes it so good is because the vast majority of Necromorphs are melee focused. And even then, the alt fire is a good, reasonable ranged ability, so... Oh, malfunction. Uh, okay. Locked. Oh. Where am I going, then? What's that? Oh. <laughs> oh, it's only you. No, I remember you. Oh. Oh, I see. The malfunction was because of the... Because of Team Gribblies here. Can I come in now? Oh. Okay. How jolly convenient. Conduit room, no access. Huh. I feel like I might end up going back there at some point. I can't be bothered to go loot their corpses. There's surely more interesting things to do. Okay, I was assuming that was going to stop. Nicole, that you? Wow, don't mind the hell train. <laughs> that was rather jarring. <laughs> to be honest, I expected that thing to uh, stop. Hence why I just spent a while staring at it. Oh no! Public transport's been cancelled. Okay, so... Hmm? Oh. Can't shoot through the door? Okay. I'm already, like, very familiar with the horrible flesh bats. Horrible things that you are. Line racks never use those even once. Maybe they're super good. Who's. Oh. Hello. No, don't run or anything. 
Aha, look at that. You tried to trick me, didn't you? You tried to lure me into a full sense of security, not expecting that I might count the number of shots of which it takes to kill you guys, and noting that uh, you didn't take the number of shots. Mm. You were no match for my functioning brain and ability to count small numbers. Mm -hmm. Although, to be fair, your brain is not functioning, so I do have a significant advantage in that regard. Just like these corpses don't actually have anything. You, on the other hand, look like a trap. No? Okay, fine. Oh, is this one of the hacking thingies? How did this work again? Find the blue with the mouse? Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. Boy, this sure is riveting, ain't it? Yay! Apparently that was my objective. I have an itchy nose, okay? Do you reckon you could give me a break? Thanks. If I have to wait for the train to arrive, you best believe I'm going to wait, like, with my back to the wall. <laughs> no. Triple no. On a scale of 1 to 10, 0. Anyone else? Probably not, it looks like the door's open on the far side. Ripper, can I please highlight the Ripper? Okay, no, I'm full on that. Fine. As full as one can be, anyway. I heard something gargle. Okay. Yay. I wonder how good the javelin thrower is. Like, given, like, my... That using the Ripper proved to be, like, an interesting experience. Oh, dear. Does make me more inclined to check out the other guns. Sure, why not, Isaac? Why not? Oh, dear. Isaac, for goodness sake. You are ridiculous. <laughs> this was a bizarre section. <laughs> that was an odd noise. Go away. Anyone else? No? Good. Yay. Line racks again. More contact energy? Sure, why not? In the event of more giant monsters, I'd like that. Oh, now what? Hell's bells. Nope. Okay, sure, we'll just ride it. Don't worry, it's fine. Ooh. Ooh. Contact energy. Why am I hanging in me there? My foot's stuck on something, is it? Am I... What am I looking for here? Am I just hanging around? Ah. No, this is a defend yourself while you're hanging in midair like a numpty from the enemies that are coming your way. Delightful. Bloody public transport. Looks like that's the last time I was in London. Oh. Nope. Blimey, alright. Give it a break. Oh god. Okay. My initial reaction to go for the line was apparently wrong. Oh. Ow. <sighs> Again, fucking public transport. Okay. 
Okay, so my immediate thoughts are like, why would Dana care? Like, this whole necromorph explosion on the ship, or station, whatever you want to term it, seems like the generally unlikely occurrence. Like, I know that the marker sort of made all this shit happen, but like, surely there needs to be an entry point for the actual fleshy contamination, if you see what I mean. Like, the, the actual necromorphs to spawn. Like, I thought on the planet that happened because it was, like, actually near the marker. Like, was the big horrible slug monster thingy. You know, that ridiculously easy end boss from Dead Space 1. Like, I assumed the actual physical proximity, like, needed necessary to poke somebody and give them the, the necromorph illness, whatever you want to call it was clear and present in Dead Space 1, but are you implying that it can just grow from your brain space, like, now as a signal? I don't know, maybe that's possible. Like, if you... If the signal sort of exists and propagates inside a conscious mind, then I guess it's not impossible that they might be able to rewire your hormones or, like, cells in such a way to create the stuff or whatever, or mutate spontaneously by desire. Yeah, I don't think that's the right way to put it, but like, I I don't know, I just feel like it's a bit unexplainable at the moment, but then we are largely in the dark. Maybe I'm just overthinking things without giving the game chance to give me context. But to be honest, I'm given the game's history with uh, people, I'm already inclined to believe that Dana might be a hallucination or something imaginary. Uh, I hope I'm wrong, because that seems a little obvious. But for now, since we've found a save point right here, and I'm a little pressed for time today, I think we'll leave it there. So, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode.